Is it the right time to buy or sell NEO stock? In this video, we will be delving deep into NEO. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, October 25, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more comprehensive analysis. Make sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any important updates that could impact your investments. Improve your trading decisions by trying out our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of artificial intelligence and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. As of October 12, 2023, our system has identified NEO as a potential sell candidate, with a score of minus 3.18. Now, let's analyze how the stock has performed during this period. The stock has experienced a loss of minus 9.95%. This indicates an average daily loss of minus 1% since it was classified as a sell candidate. This stock is currently experiencing a significant downward trend in the short term, and it's expected to continue falling. Based on the last three months, there's a potential minus 43.34% change over the next three months, with a possible return ranging from minus 49.83% to minus 31.94%. Looking at the 12-month trend, it suggests a minus 7.70% change over the next year, with a potential return ranging from minus 16.34% to 84.19%. This means the stock price could range from $6.36 to $14 after a year. In our latest update on NEO, we discuss the recent movement of the stock price and whether it is still a good investment. On Wednesday, the NEO stock price experienced a decrease of 6.06%. It went from $8.09 to $7.60. Throughout the day, the stock fluctuated between a low of $7.60 and a high of $7.85, showing a 3.29% variation. Over the past two weeks, there has been a loss of 15.27%. Interestingly, the trading volume also decreased, which can be seen as a positive indicator since volume tends to follow the stock. Specifically, there was a decrease of 14 million shares in volume, with a total of 28 million shares bought and sold, amounting to approximately $213.83 million. Looking at the broader picture, the highest stock price in the past 52 weeks was $16.18, while the lowest was $7. Currently, the price is 53.03% below the 52-week high, equivalent to $8.58, and 88.66% below the all-time high, which was achieved on January 11, 2021, when the price reached $66.99. Analyst Ratings on Monday, June 12, 2023, UBS gave NEO a neutral grade with a hold action. Citigroup also reported on Monday, June 12, 2023, giving NEO a buy grade with a hold action. JP Morgan gave NEO a neutral grade with a downgrade action on Tuesday, March 14, 2023. Telsey Advisory reported on Thursday, March 2, 2023 giving NEO a neutral grade with a downgrade action. Citigroup gave NEO a hold grade with a hold action on Thursday, December 29, 2022. Analysts have given NEO stock a general buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as a strong buy and the price-to-book ratio as strong buy. As for return on investment, the analysts give the stock a rating of neutral. Today, let's take a look at the signals for NEO stock. Currently, there are mixed signals in the stock market. Both short and long-term moving averages suggest a negative forecast for the NEO stock, indicating a sell signal. Additionally, the relation between these two signals also suggests a general sell signal, where the long-term average is above the short-term average. If the stock price corrects upwards, it may face resistance at the levels of $7.86 and $8.85. However, if the stock manages to break above these levels, it will issue a buy signal. 
It is worth noting that the volume of trading has fallen along with the price during the last trading day. This reduction in volume with price movements helps reduce the overall risk. On Friday, October 20, 2023, a buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point, and since then, the stock has risen by 0.264%. This suggests a further rise until a new top pivot is found. Additionally, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Here are some other signals that you might find interesting. The moving average convergence divergence indicator shows a buy signal. The pivots indicator generated a buy signal four days ago. The Bollinger Bands indicator gave a buy signal three days ago. The short-term moving average indicator indicated a buy signal three days ago. The long-term moving average indicator issued a sell signal 52 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages suggested a buy signal 49 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see the following signals. The short moving average indicator generated a sell signal 54 days ago. The long-term moving average indicator indicated a sell signal 28 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages suggested a buy signal 24 days ago. Don't forget to visit our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Let's talk about support, risk, and stop loss for NEO. NEO has found support from accumulated volume at $7.59. This level presents a potential buying opportunity as we can expect an upward reaction when the support is tested. This stock typically has average movements during the day, and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. In the last day, the stock had a price range of $0.250, which is equivalent to 3.29% of its value. Over the past week, the stock has shown a daily average volatility of 5%. Before we explore the potential trading levels for NEO, let's first understand some important fundamental data. One of the key metrics to consider is the price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio. This ratio helps assess a company's current share price in relation to its per share earnings. A negative PE ratio indicates that the company is either experiencing losses or has negative earnings. Established companies may have occasional downturns due to external factors. However, if the P-E ratio remains consistently negative, it could indicate insufficient profitability and potential risks of bankruptcy. Moving on, the upcoming earnings report for Q3 2023 is scheduled for November 8, 2023. Analysts' consensus estimates for this report are at dash $0.430. It's important to keep a close watch on these figures as they can significantly impact stock prices. Today, let's dive into the potential day trading levels for NEO. In an upward trend, the first resistance level for NEO sits at $8.55. If you're not already invested, it might be wise to wait until this level is surpassed before entering a position. For those who already hold the stock, this could be an interesting level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, NEO encounters its first support level at $7.59. If this support holds, it could present a promising entry point, with the anticipation of a rebound. We have evaluated this stock negatively and have not set a stop loss. Is NEO stock a good investment option? Unfortunately, NEO currently has several negative signals, which suggests that it may perform weakly in the near future. As a result, our evaluation of this stock is negative. However, upon analyzing the volatility and movements from the last trading day, our systems have found that the current price of NEO is undervalued. Looking ahead to Thursday, October 26, we anticipate that NEO will open up at $7.68, with an increase of $0.0833. Before we begin, it's important to remember that trading comes with a high risk of potential losses. It's always wise to consult a financial advisor before making any buying or selling decisions. Please note that StockInvest.us is not a reliable source for determining your investment choices. By utilizing the information provided, you acknowledge and take responsibility for your own investment decisions. Welcome to Stock Invest. Today, we'll be discussing our current view on a particular stock. 
We're excited to hear your thoughts, so please comment below and share your opinions. We're also curious about your target for this stock. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more trading insights. Wishing you successful trading and a wonderful day from all of us here at Stock Invest.